piece or want to talk about a subject that comes to mind, and that is Tariq is Ghost's son, not James. When it comes down to it, basically Ghost and James are two different people, but they're inside of that one person. And we all know that basically when it comes down to it, that James is a different person. He doesn't really want to be Ghost, and he was trying to get away from being Ghost in power. The very beginning of power, he was trying to escape being Ghost, but people kept wanting him to be Ghost. Um, Tasha and Tommy, they were like, we can't escape this life. You're big. You're on a whole other level. But he did not want to be Ghost. Now, when it comes down to it, um, basically, this man, when he when he wanted to become Ghost, he became Ghost to deal with the streets. He had to become cold. He had to become calculating. He had to become smart. He uses smarts to get money in the streets. He became that Ghost persona, and he was Ghost for a long time. However, when it comes down to it, he still wanted to be himself. He still wanted to live a life where he could be who he was. He wanted to be a person that was important, someone who was in the hood, someone who was helping people and being someone who can show you, hey, I went from the hood and I got here too. But he just he did not want to talk about the fact that he became this this drug guy this drug lord and he got to where he was going to now this is the thing about him uh, when it comes to ghosts this is someone he became when he was young i often compare him to michael from the wire where if you look at michael in the wire uh season four he was a good kid he was trying to just be a good kid but over time he eventually become became a hitter and one of the most toughest hitters in the street and basically that's what i think is it has happened happen or is going to happen to ghosts um basically he's just a regular good kid he doesn't want nothing to do with the life but when he saw how the streets was he became who he was now basically there were people talking about him in the past and that was pretty much like tommy when he said that ghost always kept his face in the book was great with numbers and was very smart but he ended up dying in the life that he is in and Tasha too, who said ever since she met him, he was very special and that she saw something in him that she knew he was going to be great or knew he was going to do good things and that he was smart and he was different from everybody else. So when it comes down to it, that's really, that's James. They talking about James. James is that intelligent kid that loves to keep a book in his face that's always trying to do something. But James had to become Ghost to be who he is. And he built his lifestyle off of being the biggest drug dealer in New York. So that's why I say that Tariq is more of Ghost's son than he is James son, James's son. Because at the end of the day, Tariq took the Ghost path. And even though James was doing everything he could to lead Tariq into the James path and be greater than him, Tariq went straight into the Ghost path and with Tariq even wanting him to be ghost of telling him you are ghost and he was saying I'm not ghost anymore I'm not that person anymore and for the series to pretty much begin with him saying he was trying to escape that person his son comes and wants to, him to be ghost wants him to become that person and he's telling him you don't want nothing to do with that life and now when it comes down to it Tariq is in regret because in the end he ended up now in this life where he doesn't even want to be a part of the life anymore so at the end of the day when it comes down to it that's why i'm talking to you guys that's uh, to tell you that Tariq is ghost's son not james even though he is james's son he's involving more into james as the series goes on but that's pretty much all i got to say in regards to that i just want to say to all of you that it is your boy bobby beast here i just want to say much love much respect hold it down and one